All right, well, let's uh, let's talk about this other Bears running back here, Tariq Cohen, getting a little hate because he dropped the ball, so he must not be any good. No, he can't catch. He dropped oh, it. He's I a running him. back wide receiver combo now. Yeah. yeah, but he dropped it. I saw him drop it. He can't catch. Chubb was about to blow him up right there <laughs> for the record. but For the record. Chubb was tracking him down. He was playing linebacker on that play, not defensive end. It was impressive, but Chubb's out there running around. Anyway, we'll get to the Broncos in a little bit. Yeah. So there's definitely – there was there was a just a – plethora of off-season write-ups about how Cone was going to be used, what Cone was going to be doing, and the stock shot through the roof. Right now, I think you're you're seeing a little bit of dip in Cohen's stock, and it's because you know you're not seeing anything out of the preseason, and everyone's so reactionary on everything. And, and you know we're guilty of the same kind of things when it fits your narrative, of course. Um, so if you didn't like Cohen, you're hating him right now, right? Um, hmm. But do you really think that they're gonna? come out here and Nagy, who's basically got this job for the offensive mind that he is, is going to come out here and show you how he's going to use Cohen? Come on, man. Doesn't have to. Why no would need he? to. We got Cohen. When you could just hand it off to Jordan Howard, he'll bully you down the field. Right. Ty- Tyreek Hill Jr. And no respect, no disrespect to Tyreek Hill by even bringing him into conversation with Cohen because Cohen's got to do a lot before he's into conversation with Tyreek Hill. It's just system and perceived Coaching. ability. Yeah. You know, the, the potential same type of hybrid type player. And like you said, Casey, there's no reason for the coach Nagy to come out here and show you what he's going to do with Cohen. I think maybe he showed you a little bit, though. They they gave Taquan Mizell some run, and he had smoke. eight targets, caught seven balls for 29 yards and a touchdown. That's exactly what the Cowboys did with their backup without Zeke in there running those plays. They were trying right. to work those things out and letting Dak get some reps through those plays and just letting the offensive line and everything get those reps in live action against another team. And that's a, that's a good point. That's a good oh, point I about love what happened. Smoke Mizell name drop. I, I liked him as a just a throwaway last year for yeah, just coming in doing what he was he was awesome he was in a name draft but again <laughs> he looks good he looks good again in this preseason so definitely got to just keep your eye on my looks very elusive out there mm. betty cunningham looks good when he gets his shots he too, always so. does so underrated yeah. he's hated on but don't Bad name point of this is don't be down on your Tariq cohen shares just because he had, no, I don't went over so. one in the preseason and hasn't Catching yeah ball. hasn't hasn't really shown like like anything crazy usage or awesome plays or anything. It hasn't showed you anything crazy since week one of last year when he came out and blew up and then the other well, team... Game did, did, was pretty solid from Tariq last year. I mean, yeah, I, I think mean, he some, had 100 targets. Yeah, he, he, he was... There's no way Tariq Cohen had 100 targets last year. Did he have 100 targets? He didn't have 100 maybe, targets. Maybe not, but... You probably thought you saw a couple targets when he was running back that punt return in, the, at the, in the overtime when he got pushed out of bounds and then Jordan Howard got a touchdown. 71 targets. Yeah, that's not 100, but that's still, that's still a. F- but uh, 20 of them in the first two weeks. That's I think a you lot just of say things. Me? Yeah. 20, 20 targets in the first two weeks? Okay, 20 is a little <laughs> exaggeration, but he got, if he got, I mean, he got he a lot. Yeah, I, you just say he, things. A little, I, little, I embellish a little bit because it's fun, but I guarantee if you look at the game log, the majority of his targets came in two games because they were. He had 12 targets in game one. Okay, yeah, that, that's more than, that's 60% of the way to 20. So what did he get in game two? Nine. Oh, that's how many? 19. That's 21. That's how that math works Ooh, out. Yeah, it is. Thank so you, you meant for twenty me. combined, not in each. Yeah, but twenty. Uh, yeah, right. exactly. I was right. one under. It was twenty-one targets in two games, so I didn't. It was embellish. twelve nine, and then four four one three 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 six two. So I was four. dead on. Man, yeah. all mm. right. How not bad, Big Co. He finished bad. the season with eight targets. <laughs> Eighty. Eight. Eight. Oh, eight. The last, the last game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gotcha. Week seventeen. Anyway. All right. Enough of the Cohen talk. 